Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Kelly Clarkson interrupts moment of silence with nasty announcement for conservatives. Paybacks coming. Singer Kelly Clarkson went on a pointless rant that ruined a moment of silence for victims of the incident that occurred in Santa Fe where numerous people had lost their lives from the actions of a single person at fault. Clarkson was speaking at the Billboard Music Awards when she pointlessly interrupted the moment of silence dedicated to the victims so that she could push her own anti-Second Amendment agenda. Clarkson used her time on stage to abuse her platform and push an agenda once again pushing politics into entertainment and likely ruining the night for millions of viewers who use entertainment to escape reality and enjoy themselves. Clarkson now faces a harsh reality in the form of paybacks from her fans who will likely alienate her for utilizing her fame to push political agendas, particularly anything that takes away constitutional rights. The performer talked about thoughts and prayers not working. She wants a moment of action and talked about parents stepping up. Here's a bit more information from Scary Mommy who covered what Clarkson did at the event. I'm a Texas girl and my home state has had so much heartbreak over this past year. And once again, you all, we're grieving for more kids that have died for just no reason at all, Clarkson, the host of the show, told the audience. She said she was supposed to stand up and offer a moment of silence for the victims and their families, but she, like most of us, are sick of being passive in our reaction to these horrific events. So she decided to use her platform to implore people to act instead. I'm so sick of moments of silence, she said through tears. It's not working, obviously, so why don't we not do a moment of silence? Why don't we do moment of action? Why don't we do a moment of change? This most recent school shooting, which is a sentence that should never, ever have to be written, at Santa Fe High School marks a year in which deaths from school shootings are officially higher than the deaths in our military. And it's only May. Thoughts and prayers and love and support are doing absolutely nothing. This is unacceptable. The singer-slash-songwriter continued, Why don't we change what's happening? It's horrible. Mamas and daddies should be able to send their kids to school, to church, to movie theaters, to clubs. You should be able to live your life without that kind of fear, she said. We need to do better. Santa Fe wasn't the only school being remembered during last night's show. Performers Sean Mendez and Khalid were joined on stage by members of the Marjorie Stoneman Douglas Show Choir. Clarkson, like all parents, says she can't imagine getting the call that one of her kids' schools has been targeted. Sadly, this is a call that so many American parents receive and it has to stop. Change has to happen because what we're doing isn't working. We need to do better, Clarkson said. Because we're failing our children. We're failing our communities. We're failing their families. One thing that many people who keep talking about anti-Second Amendment nonsense continue failing to address is placing the blame on the criminal who committed the horrible actions. The celebrities keep talking about the National Rifle Association and Americans loving their Pro-2A steel, but they forget to blame the people who are actually responsible for the crime. The people abusing their platform and speaking out against law-abiding citizens continue to lack common sense and logic and base their words on their anti-2A agenda instead of solving the real problem or placing blame on the criminal themselves. Clarkson made a point that we need to do better because we're failing our children but she didn't point out that the people who are to blame are the parents themselves. A home with good parenting usually doesn't produce a child who commits acts of violence. A lot of the younger parents have failed their children by spoiling their kids, giving them everything they want not providing firm discipline and structure, demanding participation awards, and by being friends with their children instead of being their parents. The younger parents need to step up their game and start being better parents to their children. A home with respect, discipline, rules, responsibility, and love will send forth a well-rounded child who acts appropriately in public. Some parents let their children run wild, or they abuse them, and both have negative effects on how the children turn out. If someone thinks back to 1999 when the Columbine incident took place, then imagine how many of those students now have their own children. Parents in that age bracket or a bit older should know how to raise their kids so that they're not at school bullying others. The moment of action is to be better parents and better friends to each other. If everyone treats each other better, then what reason would someone have to commit horrible crimes such as what happened at Santa Fe and Marjorie Stoneman Douglas? Did Kelly Clarkson or anyone like her ever think about why these crimes are happening? How is not the problem, but why is what should be fixed? Why are people committing these crimes and how can parents, families, and friends help stop it? How many fans will Kelly Clarkson lose? That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.